Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for October 18th of 2025 is titled 3D Bennu. So what do we see here? Well, here we see the asteroid known as 101955 Bennu. And if you have red and blue 3D glasses, you can use those to view the asteroid in 3D. And that's taken by a couple of different images but by the OSIRIS-REx spacecraft back in December of 2018, when the spacecraft was less than 100 kilometers away from the asteroid. Now, it visited the asteroid and actually collected a sample of material from the asteroid for return to Earth. So, OSIRIS-REx then left Bennu in May of 2021, making a two-and-a-half-year trip back to Earth and returning to Earth with a sample in September of 2023. So, we now have bits of an asteroid to study. And what's the big deal there with some small asteroid? Well, asteroids are actually very interesting because many of them are what we call primitive objects. They are objects that are unchanged since the early history of the solar system. So, some asteroids like this are much like they would have been four and a half billion years ago when the planets, such as Earth, were forming. So we're getting to see a little bit of that material and being able to study what the material was like that eventually made up Earth. Now, that material has since been changed on Earth, being exposed to high temperatures and pressures, and most of the material was melted, and that allowed it to separate out by density. And that is a process called differentiation that occurs on all larger worlds. And what it means is that the metallic material, the metal, will sink down to the core, and the lighter materials, the ices, the water, the gases that make up our atmosphere, will rise to the surface with the rocks kind of in between there. So, this is the bit of material that has not gone through that process, and it is a more pristine sample of the type of material that existed in our early solar system that built Earth. So, we're getting a chance to look at that type of material and study it in far more detail and better ways that will allow us to better understand the early history of our solar system. Evidence will exist here that doesn't exist on Earth because it was destroyed as rocks were melted and separated and changed. Well, that material is still present here, and the materials that OSIRIS-REx brought back to Earth will help us to better understand the early history of our solar system. So that was our picture of the day for October 18th of 2025. It was titled 3D Bennu. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be 67P. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.